myself, Mainavati, Assistant Professor, Department of Mathematics in Kaiser College of Arts and Science for Women. My topic is discrete mathematics. Uh, this video we will discuss Unit 1, 2, 3. The Unit 1 topics are the foundations, the logic and the proofs, proportional, proportional, propositional and the applications of propositional, proportional equivalences, predicates and quantifiers. Uh, logic is the study of formal reasoning. In discrete mathematics, we primarily deal with the proportional logic and the predicate logic. What is meant by predicate logic? Proportional logic involves simple statement called propositional that can either be true or false. Proof techniques. Proofs are logically argument that demonstrate that the truth of mathematical statement. The unit one conclusion is logic and proof are essential in discrete mathematics providing the structure and the record needed for previous reasoning and the validation of mathematical statements. Proportional and the predicate logic lay the groundwork for constructing the logical arguments while various proof techniques ensure these arguments are sound and conclusion. Unit 2. The topics are counting, the basics of counting, pigeon hole principle, Formidation and combination, generalized formidation and combination, generating formidation and combination. The counting in discrete mathematics involves a variety of techniques to determine the number of ways events can occur. Basic principles include the addition and the multiplication principles, formidations and combination. Advanced method like the principle of inclusion, exclusion, binomial theorem, generating functions and recurrence relations provide a powerful tool for solving more complex counting problems. Permutation means the permutation concern the argument of object where order matters. Number of permutations of n distinct object n factorial. Combination. Combinations concern the selection of object where order does not matter. Generating function. Generating functions are used to study sequence and to solve counting problems. Recurrence relation. Recurrence relations define sequence recursively. Then unit 3. The topics are advanced counting techniques, applications of recurrence relations, solving linear recurrence relations, generating function. Advanced counting uh, techniques. Ad Advanced counting techniques in discrete mathematics involve methods and principles for counting objects, arguments and combinations simultaneously. Symmetrically, the unit 3 conclusion is advanced counting techniques provide a toolkit for taking a wide range of combinatorial problems. By using principles like a pigeon hole principle, inclusion, exclusion, generating functions and recurrence relations, complex counting problems can be symmetrically approached and solved. Thank you.